Previously, we have learned the history of uh, history of uh, Sheikh Uthman bin Fudi, as well as uh, Muhammad Bello bin Sheikh Uthman bin Fudi. Now we are going to look at the history of Asma bin Uthman bin Fudi. Under this, we look at her birth, her educational career and as well as her contribution to the development of Islam. To so start with, Nana Asma bint Uthman bin Fudi was born in 1793 CE. She was Fulani by tribe, a poet, a scholar, a teacher of both men and women. He contributed a lot towards the development of Islam and this Nana Asma bin Uthman bin Fudi was twins and the twins brother was uh, Hassan. When they were given back to Uthman bin Fudi named her Asmao so that he can get the blessing from Asma bin Abu Bakri. You know, Asma bin Abu Bakri contributed a lot when Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam and his father Abu Bakri <coughs> radiallahu an <coughs> was when migrating from Mecca to Medina when they hide, when they hid in the cave of Thaw, Asma was the one supply them food, giving them food. So for that, Sheikh Osman bin Fudi wanted to name Hassan and uh, Husayna. He said no. He will name Hassan as the tradition and also give the female one Asma so that the girl can be of uh, useful to the development of Islam. There were 22nd and 23rd children of Sheikh Uthman bin Fudi. But despite that, they were able to receive fatherly cares and responsibility by their father. This Nana Asma, starting from his, her educational career, she learned Quran from her parents, that is both the mother and the father. She was an Islamic scholar, her Fizotul Quran, who memorized the glorious Quran, and at the same time, she was very fluent in three languages, Arabic, Fulfude, and uh, Hausa. This Nana Asma was very good in Hadith, Fikihu, and also she contributed a lot towards the development of Islam, the Jihad of Sheikh Uthman bin Fudi through her poem. She wrote a lot of poem in educating people the reason for jihad and the real teachings of uh, Islam, which she promote moral in the society. This Nana Asma bin Abu Bakri, sorry, 
Nana Asma bint Sheikh Osman bin Fudi got married in the year 1807 and she died in the year 1864. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have mercy on her. With this, we have a lot of lessons. Being a female does not mean that you have nothing to contribute to the development of Islam or knowledge. She contributed the Lord. She changed a lot of people's life regarding to their religion of Islam and their social uh, relation. So she died, as we said earlier, she died in the year 1864. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. Oh, sorry. Before we leave, your assignment is mention three lessons contained in the life of Asma bin Sheikh Osman bin Fudi. For your contribution, observation, questions, and the rest, you can reach us through 080-3828-4614 on WhatsApp. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guide us our right. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.